Christian attached to it. Here's Steve, side of the goal. Anderson being knocked about out front. Cross, Robertson, wrap one off the pads. Trying to get it back up to the blue line. They do, Shaw to the goal, scores! Logan Shaw makes it 4-2 with a power play goal with 2.34 remaining. And the Marlies get a goal. 3.30 into the hockey game and they're set. Oh well, as Abrazizi got there, but uh, it all got bunched up. They'll try it one more time. Hollowell looks for options, finds Abrazizi behind him with a little bit of speed. Anderson trying to kick it back down the boards. It comes loose, up high. Hollowell turning hard, scores! What a absolute bomb from Logan Shaw as he ties it up at three apiece. Getting the Marlies back even. Logan Shaw leans into this one and buries it past Caden Primo. Bernard trying to move his way all the way through, doesn't do it. Shaw picks it up across the blue line, backhander scores! Beauty move by Logan Shaw, who picks up his second of the hockey game and puts the Marlies up 5-3. Great play by Shaw. Great pass, outlet, gets a step, moves it to the backhand and man. Boy, he got messed up there with a lot of bodies, but maybe intentionally. Steves, cross, finding help. Steves again, Anderson, cross to Shaw, scores! He pounds that into the back of the net, and Logan Shaw puts the Marlies up 3-1. There's a sonic boom behind that one. Anderson sees him, Shaw captures it. Shins Blandisi steals it away on his backhand as he moves it around for Joey Anderson. Playing without the cage tonight too, by the way. And now Logan Shaw holding it down into the corner with four and a half left to go. Anderson working his way back to the puck. Pops loose behind the goal on the backhand, drops out front. Shaw scores as he lifts it over the goaltender and puts the Marlies up 4-2 with 4.22 remaining on the 28th shot of the hockey game. His second goal of the game as well as he had two the other night here in Laval. So four points for, or four goals rather, for Logan Shaw. Shaw wins it back, Steves. Oh, he wanted that shot. Target Chintz have back, Steve's cross. Shaw comes back, they keep it in the zone. Back over Target Chintz have. Out front looking for Anderson. He got the tip, but it went high. Finding Steve's again. Shaw, Steve's waiting for it. That shot scores in overtime. Logan Shaw with the hat trick. And the Marlies win, picking up the extra point. What a night for Logan Shaw. What a couple of games that he has played here for Toronto. And the Marlies are going home with four points from a trip to Laval. Don't. Hollowell sends it in. Shaw gets after it quick. On the wraparound, scores! Logan Shaw, what a play by the Marlies as they have Shaw going full speed across the blue line. Dumped in hard off the end boards. He picks it up from there and finds a whole lot of space as Logan Shaw, who is at the tops in the American Hockey League and scoring adds one there. 1%, just under 70% on the road, that's 30th league wide. So the Monsters in the box as a tripping call, leveled against Olivier LeBlanc and Ice breaking goal sought now by the power playing Marlies. They win the Ozone draw. Big drive, left circle, they score. Logan Shaw lowers the boom from atop that left dot. And that took very little time. 11 seconds into the power play. Number 11, Shaw makes it one nothing Marlies. 
Well, that was efficient to say the least. Shaw's the leading scorer for the Marlies this year, and he scores at exactly seven minutes of the first period. That tally, his eighth of the year and 21st point. And a pass came back to the right point for Semyon Durard. Gichinsev, he sent it across to the top of the Back line. out front. That one came off the boards in a perfect spot, but no shot taken on the play. Little whack at the line. This one comes back out, and now here's a chance for Shaw. Breakaway, shorthanded, backhand, scores! Logan Shaw picks up the shorthanded goal. With Joe Blandisi in the box, and the Marlies tie it up at one apiece. Takes the shot, and Shaw, does he get it? Keep it in, Villeneuve does. As he works down the boards, moving it back up. Shaw looks in, cross ice, target Jinsev. Down side of the goal, looking out front. Abrazizi, Shaw scores! Hard into the net, Logan Shaw. And the Marlies get on the board first and the power play once again finds success for Toronto. Abrazizi waited it out and you, but right out to McMahon, backhander, and there was Anderson, but he couldn't find the handle. Back up for Hoffenmeyer. Shaw lets one fly and hit the side of the goal, and that gave the fans something to think about. Back at the blue line, back to Shaw again. Look, shoots, scores! Logan Shaw ties it up! With a dart to the back of the goal with less than 50 seconds to go in the third period. Well, the Marlies have been doing such a good job, even before they got Wall out of the net, of controlling the puck in the zone, getting some scoring opportunities. You can see here just battling, getting to pucks first. And, and a good play and a good stick on it keeps it from being harmful. Abrazizi out front, Shaw scores! What a feed, what a finish, Logan Shaw. Well, you talk about guys that like to shoot the puck. Nick Abrazizi is the guy that likes to make a play, likes to make a nice pass. He didn't complete it on the first opportunity. He didn't make any mistake the second time he got the puck on his stick. And again, some good work down low. And you see this nice little turn back, catches Shaw coming into the slot. Tape to tape right on his forehead. As the Marlies break back the other way, Hoffemeyer, Abrazizi waits on it. Good patience. They got him scrambling now as it goes towards the goal. Shoots, he scores! Logan Shaw from the slot puts it past Malcolm Subban and ties it up at one apiece with 134 left to go in the first period. Shaw with a great chance. Abrazizi starts this out with some good patience. Knocked down, and Shaw got it in the hand, threw it on the ground, hangs on, tries to go cross ice. Target Chinsev picks it up, and now they've got a couple caught behind. Castles recognize he had to get in there quick. Abrazizi looks cross ice. Anderson backside scores! Logan Shaw! The Senators took a chance at one end, caught two men deep, and the Marlies took advantage at the other with a power play goal to tie it up at two apiece as Logan Shaw adds another one onto an already. I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> Here's Logan Shaw. It's a memory you don't lose. Here's Dargachinsev, looks to the goal. Cross ice shot, scores! An absolute blast into the back of the net. Logan Shaw picks up his second of the night, his 15th of the season, and his second on the power play as he restores the Marlies lead 4-3 with a minute 16 left to go in the second. And now Dargachinsev looked down toward the goal, drops into the corner, Shaw. Abrazizi picks it up, finds Hoffmeyer again, dishes it off to Abrazizi. Looks in, cross ice up top, scores! Logan Shaw on the power play, restores the Marlies lead and ties up his career-bested numbers. 
as he picks up yet another point against his former club here in Belleville. Jack O'Brien centers it out. John Stone was tied up. He got his stick way up high. Back over for Petronero. Fires it in. Jack O'Brien on goal. Lifts that one up, and it's picked up and deposited in back of the net by Logan Shaw, who found that gift right at the front door and brought it inside. Logan Shaw makes it 3-1 at 7.58 of the third period. Zach O'Brien is going to get an assist. He throws it in on goal, and then Shaw just collects it. Deming, Holmberg, and Shaw are out. Villanova as well. Position on the opposite side. He tied this game up, and it comes to Villanova. Shaw rotates around. Draws it in, takes a shot, he scores! Logan Shaw in overtime gives the Marlies the win! And the captain says it all! Oh, what a nice goal. We talked about how good both those guys, Holmberg and Shaw, have been in the face-off circle. Starts with the one face-off. Logan Shaw is able to walk the circle nice and patient. Gets his shot off and... Again, hadn't scored in four games, and you could just feel it coming with him. Lots of chances today in this game. You knew something was going to drop for him. Well, and if there's any way to break one open after four, <laughs> that's the way to do it. Joseph Wall picks up another win. With some problems. Right, right back. Miller up and out, and now a chance back. Abrazizi with Shaw. Abrazizi, Shaw scores! Logan Shaw as the Marlies get one here in the second period. And is this the one that will open the floodgates? Well, and you could see the excitement from Nick Aprazizi when that puck went in the net. You get that moment of where you think to yourself, finally. And this is a two-on-one. We haven't seen them generate. Oh, Sice, he was hoping to find Argachinsev out front of Kane and Shaw again. This one in the back of the goal with authority. Logan Shaw makes it 4-2 on the power play. Well, that one's got to feel good for Logan Shaw to get in on the action. Everyone on his line has scored. Why not? He walks the circle, releases this shot. These are the ones that just weren't dropping for the Marlies over the last number of games. Good net front by Mark Johnstone. And Abrazizi pops out front, great chance, Shaw scores! Logan Shaw with an absolute gift and he buries it. And the Marlies go up 2-1 with 3.39 left to go in this first period. After the Rockets scored the opening goal, the captain comes back and puts Toronto up 2-1. It's 20 for easy who does such a good job of that. Oh, well, taps it back. Shaw under some pressure, plays it down low. Landisi back up. Abrazizi, Hollowell. Shaw scores right in the snaffle box. Logan Shaw ties it up at three apiece. What a great shot by Logan Shaw. We've seen that before this season off that flank. Really good puck movement by the Toronto Marlies and quick. And he gets this one past Nico Dawes. Again, another little battle. Back from a 3 0 deficit. Pass ahead to Flandisi. Tip back to Shaw. Coming back through the middle. Flandisi. Shaw. Well, this Marley's team has been full of responses so far tonight, and that one did not take a whole lot of time. Logan Shaw with his second goal of the game, and a huge one, he and Blandisi connect. Good long stretch pass. Again, turning out front, Nemitz says Shogram was trying to get back to it. Shaw plays it off the boards, and now Holmberg on a run to it. Holmberg across the line and takes the 8-15 and 
to the city. As the Marlies go up 5-2, and I think Holmberg will get the final touch on this, even though I think it was gonna get across the line anyway. Either way, Shaw, Holmberg, the Marlies are gonna take game three, and you can tell because the whole building just got up and is heading to the exits. Alex Steves, the one who found him. So Horn is gonna pick up an assist as well, his first. Steves, third assist of the playoffs. Yamela picks it up from there. Back up ice and across for Shaw in close, scores! What a rip by Shaw as he buries it past Dawes to make it 3-1. What a find, what a pickup, what a close. Logan Shaw comes back with another one today. He had an empty net shorthanded goal in game number three, and he picks up a timely.